What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, I want y'all to know <coughs> I have a couples channel uh, video coming out today. Uh, it's going to be out, I'm going to say at 3 o'clock. If it ain't out at 3, it's going to be out at 6. It's going to be out at 3. Nah. It's going to be out at 3. <laughs> I'm going to put it out at 3 because I'm trying to wait till 6. I'm trying to figure out the time that we're going to do it every day. It's going to be at 3. It's going to be out at 3 o'clock today. I will be sliding the link in on the pinned comment, so y'all make sure y'all check it out. It's me and Honey Sauce. And, um, yeah, tap in. Okay? Now, the reason why I got y'all here is because our good friend done quit the internet, y'all. Krishan said, I'm deactivating all my pages. See y'all later. God bless. So everybody, you know, was in a frenzy. As you can see, there's a lot of people in the comments. I will say, though, right after that, because the comments was basically saying, like, girl, we'll see you tomorrow. Girl, you bullshitting, whatever. So then she said, she changed that title and said, changing my number, changing my address. And we like, oh, okay, so I thought you was leaving. Right. Um, and granted, I don't want Krishan to let the Internet win, bro. I don't want her to let nobody win. But for some reason, I ain't know for some reason. She's 23. She's 23 and she's being 23. And, um, you know, you can't stop that. Like you, nobody can stop that course. She got to run it. She got to run that course. So let's read some of these comments. And for one, uh, Mr. L. Davis or whatever, he is uh, he on his bully train. And I think he's on his, his bully train because he feels as though Krishan has bullied his friend. I ain't gonna lie, I cannot argue with that. If Krishan hauled ass and punched that man in the face. <laughs> now, granted, I don't know why. Respectfully, he ain't hit her ass back. I, I don't understand that. A lot of people was like, ain't he too big to basically be getting beat up? 10, 10 in the chat. I completely agree. Like, you're a grown-ass man. Why are we... What is... What? What is going on here? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Why are you... Getting beat up, so to speak. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I will not lie. I don't understand that. I don't. Uh, so for some reason, uh, they act like well, he's just the scariest thing in the world. But anyway, he said that's not going to stop the police report from coming out. Okay? So he letting her know, um, I don't care where you try and hide, you, you about to get caught. Now, here's the thing, right? Because I ain't going to lie. I wasn't necessarily taking it serious um, about her, like, because everybody, like, making it seem like she's about to go to prison. Well, Krishan asked is on probation. Completely forgot about it, because I'm like, Krishan ain't really did nothing to, uh, you know, uh, mess with the probation or whatever. I haven't seen her go to jail yet. I mean, hell, she's been on probation for about a year now. Well, this time she actually touched somebody. Now, all those other times she wasn't on probation. Yes, she just recently was put on probation. Now, remember, she's pregnant. So she wasn't fighting when she was pregnant. She did have somebody else fight her sister, but she didn't fight, you know. And this child un <sighs> now hit somebody in the face, broke his teeth. I mean, uh, chipped his tooth, excuse me, and his nose wouldn't stop bleeding. Y'all, that's bad. I'm not going to lie. And at first, I really didn't believe it. I'm like, man, that shit cap. It ain't cap. Uh, throw your pager out the window too, boo. <laughs> Yo, people are crazy. Her house was just robbed and she has a newborn baby. I get some of y'all don't like her, but there's an innocent baby involved. When did her house get robbed and where is that at? It's a guy who keeps posting stuff on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? If you see this, bro, ain't no disrespect. I'm just saying it, it ain't never no receipts. So y'all be sending me shit, and I can't believe it because it ain't no receipts. So how am I supposed to believe that? You know what I'm saying? Um, let me see. I'm trying to get into these comments. A lot of people feel some type of way that, uh, like, they saying that she her house got broken into, but nobody has a video of it, basically. Uh, if y'all haven't read the caption yet, Go read it right now. Y'all are so petty. <laughs> uh, she probably lost the house. That's why the, the address is changing. And you know what? I would agree that if she paid up for a year on that house and she's changing her address, then that would definitely mean, uh, well, it could potentially mean that her house did get broken into. I can't say it did because I don't know. She ain't came out and said it. Um, so I don't know. But if her house did get broken into, absolutely, you need to get the hell up out of there. Um, and she probably changing her number 
Because damn Tamar done flipped on her too. Um, I, as more of this unfold, I'm going to bring more to y'all. But basically, Tamar is uh, on James' side. Now, Tamar is not on the guy side that brought out the story, but she is on James' side. Also, uh, Tamar's ex, the lawyer, he's a lawyer or whatever, he is also saying that she's still going to get them, you know, them papers. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, it's a lot going on, bro. So anyway, after that, after the tweets or whatever, she absolutely deactivated that Instagram. Um, and then she hadn't activated, she hadn't deactivated Junior's Instagram yet, but she did end up deactivating Junior's Instagram as well. Um, y'all literally post her every move. I'm sure all, uh, I'm sure that's all a part of the reason, I guess. Blogging is one thing, but y'all post the girl 24 seven, the smallest thing. She's 23, have raised herself damn near. She have a lot of growing to do facts. Um, what is it with the blog and this girl? We don't care what she does. You've posted her 50 times already. Uh, she not really off social media. Her son page still active right after that. She deactivated that unpopular opinion. It doesn't matter if she deactivates it or not blogs posting. Everything she does is always going to keep her in the spotlight. Look how they posting about her not posting. Listen, I'm going to tell y'all right now when a person comes out, and they make it very clear that they don't give a damn who posts them. Well, <laughs> everybody took that and they ran with it. Point blank period. I started reacting to Krishan, but just because I just couldn't believe the buffoonery that was going on. I'm not going to lie. I react to things that I watch. Okay. So if I'm watching it, baby, I'm going to make my coin because ain't no need for me to not. Okay. I'm not watching it for free. So it's just more so like what in the hell I, I like her as a person. Um, she has one of those hearts that is challenging. Some days she's really nice and really sweet and just an angel. And then the next day, baby, she got the devil on her shoulder. No cap. Okay. Um, her family ain't making it no better. If anybody's the worst in this situation, it's her damn family. Every chance they get, they chime in on her situation. She got to be mad at anybody. I'd be mad at all my older brothers and sisters. All of Mookie, he in prison, but damn, he was a part of the problem. China is a huge part of the problem. At least Tessa uh, take up for Tessaki done came in and uh, threw up under the rug too for her to have a little bit of fame. If we're going to be upset with anybody, let's be upset with the people who are in my family. You know what I'm saying? And uh, if I was her, I'd cut all the motherfuckers off. But blogs are here to blog what you do. And I don't understand why people don't get that, but it ain't for me to keep explaining that shit either. Um, that lawyer on her tail, the lawyer is uh, Tamar's ex-boyfriend. Um, wait, come back. You forgot Junior's page. <laughs> First off, I want to thank God. Secondly, I want to thank God again. Whew. Uh, why the big bad wolf running? And I'm not going to lie. Everybody is treating Krishan like a bully. And... Y'all, she is. You know, you cannot. My daddy taught me that early when I um when I became older. You go to jail for assault. 23, 14, you go to jail for assault. Point blank period. So um that's something that uh she gonna learn today. And unfortunately, it just kind of is what it is, y'all. So we absolutely will continue to do content. Uh, my page ain't. Y'all think it's based on Krishan, but it's based on what's viral. So whatever's going on, baby, I'm going to react to it. Okay? Uh, so that's just it. That's just all. I'm going to keep bringing y'all whatever uh, I, whatever is happening. And it's something happening all day long. So continue to stay tapped in. Uh, the Couples Channel is about to uh, pick back up today. So 3 o'clock. I'm waiting on my thumbnail. But 3 o'clock, you will get a video. You dig? Y'all let me know what you're thinking down in the comment section below. Uh, I pray for Krishan. I hope she gets this shit together. Okay. And I hope she take anger management and uh, absolutely stop putting her hands on people. It's against the law. When you, when you of age, it's against the law. But all right, y'all, let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah. What's up, y'all? Got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, we're about to get into Blueface's tweets last night, um, which made Krishan say something to him in the first place. And then we're going to get into his story. 
Uh, I'm going to start with the story first because y'all know YouTube be tripping. But before we even get into that, I want y'all to know I appreciate y'all. Uh, you can skip it if you would like. But um, sometimes when I do these videos, YouTube be tripping. So we have a couple's channel. It is called Royalties and Candyland. We are dropping our first video tomorrow. I need y'all to tap in. All right. So I'm going to put uh, the video link. Well, I'm going to put the channel link in the pinned comment. Y'all show some love over there. Y'all been asking for blogs and food reviews. So we're going to get that to y'all. You dig? Um, so I just want to put that out there. Now, let's get into it. So y'all know Blue Blueface and uh, Jaden had a booking last night. Okay. Now, uh, this Jaden with no features doing her thing. I ain't no hater. And I'm still like a Barbie. Good. Hips, lips, ass in the cardi. I'm his favorite motherfucker. Hello. <laughs> Milk music. Get to it. All right. So this was the club or whatever. We don't need to see no ass shaking on the... Um, on the screen uh they had a packed house somebody said that it was free before <laughs> it was free before 12. that's why they had a packed house but girl whatever oh nah so she and people phones you know Jaden doing her thing so that was her song i don't know why she wasn't performing it right at that moment why would they play the music and not uh, -uh i don't need no cheeks now this is what superstar <laughs> all about she signed out a girl yo why Stu <laughs> stewie why Jaden signing a stewie book and y'all be in my comments all in your feelings about the stewie thing it ain't that deep bro respectfully sis got a stewie head and she knows that but they making a lot of money off her being stewie if anybody hating this y'all you know what i'm saying I'm talking about the ones in my comments. Why you got to call her Stewie? Uh, uh, shut up, girl. Shit. Anyway, Blueface had a laugh. <laughs> he got that. He got that. Hey. Ah. He viral. I got you, bro. I got you. I got you. I got you. So they was laughing because, you know, it's funny. Okay. Um, This is how Pack the House got. And this is her up there performing. And this is Blueface up there performing. <laughs> Tatiana never get old. I just listened to it the other day. Um, now, I, I may not agree with what they be doing, you know, and they grown, they do what they want, but I'm still going to listen to Tatiana. I don't give a what's going on. And Barbie, listen to that too. Okay. But I also listen to Vibe all the time. You feel what I'm saying? I also listen to My Boo and Krishan. So you can't be a hater with music. You'll never win. All right. So this was Blueface's story. And then we're going to get into uh, Jaden's story. Um, and then House of Blues as well. Uh, maybe there we go. Jaden, all right. Everybody wants to shake their ass. That's what they were doing last night. All right. So Glorilla is uh listening to Barbie. Um, this is Jaden. Twinkle, twinkle, baby. Twinkle, twinkle. <laughs> twinkle, twinkle. Yeah. Twinkle, twinkle, yeah. Twinkle, twinkle, Participate. Twinkle, Participate. Tell her. They be so lit. <laughs> Rain Keisha. Um, shout out to the uh seafood boy, cause hello. Uh just hilarious used the song. And people gotta understand they're using the song to for their picture to go viral and their story to go viral. I don't know why people don't get that, but anyway. Also, it's a good song. I ain't no hater. It's a good song. Um, all right. Blue so, first, baby. No man. This is her repping her man, girl. So I guess she ain't mad at him no more today. Or this week or whatever. Now next week might be a different story. Um, okay. That happened. And then um we got booty shaking in, in the truck or whatever. So now I would like to get to Blue Blueface's tweets. All right. So last night, him and well, him him and Krishan was not going back and forth, but I'm gonna tell y'all why Krishan has something to say. Okay. <clears throat> so what he says, and he's so random. Let's let's Go a little further. So you ain't never got to be that thirsty. Now, who are you talking about if you ain't talking about Krishan? Now, remember, Krishan was in the car the other day with her man or her new man or whatever. So he asked her, did she need something out the store? She said that she wanted a Gatorade. <clears throat> Ironic that Bluefist said that you don't have to be that thirsty. Who and what is he talking about? You know what I'm saying? So for Krishan to think that he was talking about her, I kind of don't blame her on that one. All right? Y'all did not see it. <laughs> All right, so Blufus said, you ain't never got to be that thirsty. 
Now, remember, um, Krishan said to her new man or whatever, I want a Gatorade out the store. Is he talking about that type of thirsty or what type of thirsty is he talking about? And who are you talking to? Okay. <clears throat> That's number one. Then after that, he said, stop harassing these hoes, man. Okay. The only person that was harassing somebody was Krishan the other day. <laughs> Allegedly. Allegedly, she punched somebody in the face, which would be harassment. Um, who are you talking to? It, who else went viral the other day for harassing somebody? Don't worry. I will wait. Krishan, okay? You, there's no need for me to wait. Krishan was the only one, okay? So what are we talking about? Then after that, which gave it all away, you can't beat the fag out of hoe. Just let her go. It's ironic that Krishan punched a gay man in the face. <laughs> Are you not talking about Krishan, right? And then he edited it. That was edited. So it's like, what? Who are you talking to? If you're not talking to her, who are you talking to? Okay? So, girl, Krishan was over it. And that's why Krishan ended up making the tweet that she made. Um, which was basically telling him to leave her the hell alone. So then he said, when I get the wire, when the wire hit, I will no longer be reachable. I'm going to pay somebody to answer the phone for me on schoolyard. What he need to be doing is paying off this damn house for he lose it. Okay. <laughs> this boy got a lot of stuff going on. I don't even see how <clears throat> he can even talk about money right now. But um, what else was it? Um, after Krishan said what she said, he said, this issue is getting weird. Then he said, I am not an artist. I'm not a rapper. I've been there, done that. The highest level I graduated. Now I produce artists. I create artists. I'm the label. Milf Music, let's get to it. <clears throat> and hell, I ain't mad at him for that. Um, I want to know what y'all think about this down in the comment section below. Do you think he was being a shady lady towards Jaden? Uh, excuse me, Krishan. I think he's always a shady lady towards Krishan. Any chance he get, he gonna shade her, okay? Um, and I just, I don't think it's right. It's like, leave her alone, bro. <clears throat> she can really be minding her business and out of everybody who beats her up on the internet, he just joins in. However, I will say, Krishan, why are you still giving a man the punani who shits on you every chance that he gets? You know what I'm saying? Why must you still give him the punani that also does not make zero sense at all so what are we actually doing here um y'all always want somebody to take you know for krishan to take things accountable girl i can't stop her from giving that coochie to that man that disrespectful man whoever chance he get he, he throw her right up under the bus with everybody else i never understand it um he don't do that to Jada. he he respects her in that right uh well till she piss him off you know he one of them he 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 rock with whoever till they piss him off. Um, that's why I wouldn't be able to deal with him. The temperament of him is just crazy. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below, man. As usual, please make sure y'all tap into the couple's channel, Royalties in Candyland. All right. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.